Hello, and welcome to another Tech Debt video. In today's episode, we will be demonstrating an iPhone 14 Pro Max teardown disassembly. If you see any additional tools or parts you need in the video, please make sure to visit our website, techdep.com, and pick up what you need. All parts and tools shown in the video will be linked in the description below. Let's begin. Today, we will be using a heating pad to help break the bond the adhesive will have on the screen. Set your heating pad to around 72 degrees Celsius and leave the device on it for around 3 to 4 minutes, but no longer than 5. You risk damaging the unit. Now using a pick, we will separate the screen from the housing carefully as to not damage the LCD or glass. Move along the edges and be careful to not go too deep with the pick as there are many fragile cables hidden under the screen that you will not want to be damaged. Do you or a family member have a cracked phone or laptop screen? Not to worry, here at TechDep we have you covered. Whether if you want to repair it yourself or have one of our expert technicians do the work for you, we've got your back. Check out our website in the description below to schedule an appointment, schedule a mail-in repair, or get the tools and parts you need for your repair today. Gently tilt the screen up making sure to not tear the cables running to the LCD. We must now remove the cover over the mainboard. After removing the mainboard cover, we can now safely unplug the LCD connection and remove the LCD assembly from the unit. First, start by removing the Torx screws attached to the board by using a Torx T1.5. Then proceed by removing the tri-wing screws from the rear camera. Make sure you disconnect all the flex cables connected to the mainboard, as there are some only accessible after you remove the inside plate where the small connector of the charging dock is located. After removing the plate of the rear camera, gently pull it out from the bottom right, then the top. Proceed by removing the front camera and top speaker as they are linked with one Phillips screw. Gently pull out the front Face ID camera, then the front speaker. Note that the 13 series and above do not have the proximity sensor soldered into it. After removing the front speaker, remove the last Torx screw attached to the main board.
Prepare the battery for removal. Use 90% or higher isopropyl alcohol to help dissolve and weaken the glue holding the battery in. Additionally, we will turn the heating pad back on and set it to a temperature of 72 degrees Celsius. Again, to further help persuade the adhesive to let go of the battery. Let the device heat up and soften the glue for about 5 to 10 minutes or until it's easy to pry up. When prying the battery out, be extra careful to not puncture or pierce the battery. Doing so may result in a lithium battery fire and is extremely dangerous. Remember, the slower the better when it comes to removing the battery. This wraps up another Tech Depth Teardown Disassembly tutorial video. We hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, comments, or feedback, please leave them in the comments below. Remember to check out our website, techtep.com, for any of the parts and tools shown in today's video. Thank you for your support. We greatly appreciate it.